Well, today was an opportunity for us to unveil the, uh, the launch of a, a program that is going to see energy literacy sessions taking place across the province. I think the important thing is that we're going out to educate people more to take care of some of the myths that might be around liquefied natural gas. If you watch the presentation today, there's a lot of myths that just don't exist. This stuff isn't ex explosive. It's uh, clean. Light that and start up here and just come on down and we're going to find, so this is too lean of an environment, not enough fuel. We're going to find that band of flammability. There you go. So here is the 5 to 15 percent band. Thank you, Minister. Um, you'll notice a couple of things here. One, that flame did not follow the fuel back into the container and go boom. Because why? Too rich of an environment. Also, there's a slight pressure that's pushing the fuel out. Um, and that's the way any natural gas uh, fire will burn. Is that the source of the, of the fuel? Uh, we say it burns with a lazy flame, so it looks sort of like just a big candle. And then the, th the other thing you'll, you'll notice is that there's no smoke. It's a very clean fuel. Should there ever be a spill, uh, which is rare, but it does happen, LNG will vaporize back to a gas and it will automatically go right up to the atmosphere. It's lighter than air, so it will not stick around on the land. It will not contaminate the soil. If it's spilled on water, it will again evaporate and go back to a gas form. We'll pour the water in here. And then we'll pour a little bit of LNG on top, and you'll see that it will very quickly vaporize. Again, that water is very warm compared to the temperature of the LNG. You know, we saw today uh, with the safety demonstration, which will be traveling across the province, how safe it really is. Um, you know, I had the opportunity to, uh, to actually drink uh, part of the, the product. So, uh, in fact, it is safe and we want students and families and people who live in our province to understand the industry, understand the safety record that it has, and also get the opportunity to look at what jobs may be required today and in the future.